Field family has a long and strong connection to schools and farmers. We work with stakeholders at the county level to explore ways to strengthen our community food system, and it was determined that there was an obvious gap. To make the greatest change for a stronger food system, we needed to invest in a food hub. A food hub provides infrastructure that enables local farmers to meet large wholesale orders, and for school districts, colleges, universities, and other institutions, an easy process to order quality local food from multiple farmers. We serve as a connector between local producers and farmers and institutions that serve people in our community every day. In Johnson County, we recognize that having a resilient community-based food system helps us not only eat more delicious meals, but helps sustain general community health for the environment and for our bodies. From a sustainability factor, from an overall health and well-being component, there's a ton of value that the opportunity to access locally grown food brings. The food Hub creates these institutional markets that traditional small farms may not have been able to access. Working with the Food Hub has really helped to get my um, farm name out. They're definitely different customers um, than I would intentionally find. It's a, it's a different scale. So they've really targeted schools which um, and they've cultivated those relationships and so that's been a really great connection for us. All I need to do is just do the one-stop shopping through the food hub and not go out to all those individual farmers. We would not be doing local foods if at all, um, without the Food Hub. Food Hubs are a great tool for increasing access because a lot of folks are eating maybe one of their meals a day, maybe multiple meals a day in a cafeteria connected to their school or workplace. The institutional markets are the great equalizer. The children of our, our, our community school district, regardless of the socioeconomic status, would have access to healthy, fresh food options, one example of the value that a food hub resource can bring and how it can be a, an equity driver as well. For us, we're really short staffed. We're a small but mighty team, so any efficiency shortcuts uh, really help us a lot. So having Field of Family offer free deliveries to us, we're able to get that really high quality food onto our shelves really quickly um, and at no additional cost to us. Last year, when we did the summer feeding program. One of the best things that I ever heard was that they loved um, the cherry tomatoes. This mom said, I saw my daughter eating them like candy. And that was a win-win for us. It's like the child is eating something that, you know, was good for her. It was locally produced and it was easy for us to purchase. It's a lot easier for us to drop off um, lots of lugs of apples um, for schools at one location that they can distribute it. Uh, this year we're selling basil and um, lacinato kale. I've planted maybe double that I would for the food hub. You need a certain amount of volume in order to be able to A, serve the community and also B, provide a living wage for all the folks involved in the food hub. It's a really good feeling to know that your van's full of food that's going to um, be delivered promptly um, the next day. You're supporting people that live in your community. You know, the money that you give me for a bunch of carrots, it's uh, allowing me to give jobs in the area and um, give people healthy food. Field of Family allows us to put more locally grown produce onto our shelves. We have come a long way since we started. Having a food hub in our community is a win. The continued support is required for it to grow. We know there's a lot more opportunities to get local on more menus every day. 